For a new coach, new to the game of lacrosse, I think the most critical thing is that you learn as much as you can. You've got to teach the, the players the, the correct skills. You have to understand the game. Know what their resources are. If they're a totally new coach to the sport but not new to their area, you know, there's high school coaches, there's college coaches, there's youth coaches in that area that will be a good, good source for them. You know that there is coaches education online at U.S. Lacrosse and it's a great way to, to learn a little bit about the basics of the game. Get yourself ingrained and look at U.S. Lacrosse's coaches education department as a resource. Get in there right away, look at the uh, material they have and start to take the online and the live courses. If I were talking to a new coach, I would say absolutely take advantage of all of the resources that U.S. Lacrosse has. Everything from the coaches education program, the mobile app, opportunities like this at U.S. Lacrosse Convention. Uh, you know, there are so many great resources that U.S. Lacrosse has and to take advantage of them. Go to the USL Coaching Certification Program, do that online. Uh, try and get instructional videos, drill booklets, watch as much lacrosse as you can at all different levels um, because you, you have to, you know, you have to know the game if you're going to get the respect of, of your players. Be really positive. Uh, be seen, get out there, uh, and show people that you love the game. Uh, and, it, and if you do that, I think good things are going to work out for you. Don't be overwhelmed. Each day you, you move ahead just a little bit and learn a bit more. But the biggest resource is if you can realize that Coach's Ed has is, is got that um, tremendous power to help bring proven expertise to a coach, it's the easiest step and the first step you should take. I would always encourage them to come to a place like this, come to the convention, and where you get so jazzed up about the sports you don't realize that all these things are happening. Um, and, you know, then I tell them, you know, don't take themselves so seriously. You know, you want to make sure you're having fun because then the kids are still going to have a great time when they're playing as well. I would say to anybody who's interested in coaching, it's a lot of work. And if you're going to do it right, you've got to be fully committed. And if you're not doing it for the right reasons, if you're doing it for some other reason than for the best interests of your students, then it's, coaching is not for you. And, and because of that, um, we, have such a, we have this opportunity to have such a great effect on young people. And that's what this is about.